What's up guys, if you want cheap, fast, and reliable MT, and you want to get those spotlight challenges done, hit up my new sponsor DVDJ and use code YOURBOYBUGS for 10% off a checkout. And yeah man, check them out. What's good guys, if you want cheap, fast, and reliable NBA 2K20 My Team Coins, head on over to NBASafe.com and use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout. What's good YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K20 My Team video, and guys, today... We are going to go over some market as per usual. If you guys do not know, the market is crashed. And if you guys would please drop a like on this video. And if you guys would also drop that sub, it would be greatly appreciated. Let's get this video to 120 likes. And uh, man, we're going to run this ad right quick. If you're looking to buy a stacked NBA 2K account with max badges and more, visit SportsTMB.com. He has been in the community for years and has hundreds of reviews. Click the first link in the description to get your account today. Guys, it's crazy. Like, right now, the market is insane. Like, insane. Um, Personally, I really think they have a lot of stuff coming to 2K. If you haven't noticed, they've been dropping a minimum of an Opal a week. So now... If you think about it, the game is crazy right now. 2K is money hungry. Like I said, bro, hit up my sponsor for MT. Don't give these damn people VC. Like, straight up. Don't spend your money on this game. Buy MT. It's a better buck. Like, I know I have a sponsor. I'm just saying that. But personally, I used to buy MT. Like, honestly, as a, like, when I was small, I didn't have that much money. If you think about it, their VC prices are kind of outrageous. I'm just saying. But, yo, right now. Markets kind of crash. I don't got that much VC to go by. So I just been sitting here and as you can see I do have 42 auctions. They're mostly Amethyst cards. Like I mean Amethyst cards. I kind of sat on this game for a couple hours. I've been sniping like crazy and honestly I haven't been doing the big snipes. No Galaxy Opal. I realized that if you think about it, if you waste your time, I, honestly I think it's a waste going for Opals. I know it is. You could definitely disagree with me. I understand you definitely could definitely disagree with me on going for big baller like galaxy opals but bro if you think about it the chance of you getting it like first of all the chance of it popping up is low second of all you getting it thousands of people are on the filter at once so i was thinking bro i don't have that much mt i'm with this filters money and i honestly just sat on the amethyst filter for like a couple hours i got a ton of auctions and not only that like i said the bid sniping if you guys do not remember this bid sniping has worked perfectly during this market crash one one player i'm gonna say worked out perfectly for me i made 50k off carl malone in one minute i swear i swear to you guys no lie no joke that is why 50k 58k on the screen i had no mt i flipped it bro i promise you like i promise you for some reason there was a ton of Carl Malone when the market was crashed earlier yesterday Carmel alone, there was a ton of bids up for like 9k, 9k, 6k, 2k. I was like, what the hell is going on? And they all ended at the same time. So what happened? I sold all of them for around 17.9. They all sold, they're all gone. I sold all of them. I got all of them for 9k and under. I made about what? 8k profit, 9k profit off each fast. Like I mean really fast. They sold in seconds. So I made that profit. I got my MT up quick. Now, one MT method that I'm gonna say you guys need to do is if you scroll on the auction and you see some cards, like, all right, for instance, you can see Paul Pierce is really hot in the auction right now. Pretty much any card you see just scrolling through that's really hot, you kind of want to just jump on that filter. Giannis is pretty hot right now. Aldridge is hot right now. Paul Pierce is really hot right now. So if we do look at this, I'm going to go over it. So Paul Pierce, first off, you could try bit sniping him. Honestly, I feel like it's a little hard to, but honestly, you could just really hop on the filter. So I'm going to go over his buyout right now. I know I'm speaking kind of fast. I don't know. I'm just in the 2K mood today, bro. I love when they drop opals. It's just it's just awesome. So 29 29k. So 29k. Like I get that 25k make a quick 1k profit. Honestly, I will consider that uh, it's already gone. So as you can see people are on the filter. So what you guys want to do? I could have just made 1k like that. If you guys had that 25k MT, you sold over 28 something. Picked up a quick 1,500 real quick. He would have sold in seconds, but I didn't really want to do it. I don't have that much MT to spare. But yo, right now, if you could find some bids uh, like this 21K one, if you want, since it's 23K, I would raise it to around 25. 
Now, if nobody bids on this, you're going to get it for 23K and get your MT back. You sell him for 28, you're going to make a solid 4K MT. It's not a lot, but yo, he sells in seconds. So you're going to get your 4K, 3K MT, and I mean seconds. This one for 20K, same thing. Since 22K, you want to go up a little bit more. So if someone does outbid you, you're still on top, 25K. This method is very deadly. It's good for any card. It's usually good for spam cards. If the card isn't spam, it's not going to work out. So for instance, the other day, I was doing it with Ben Simmons. It worked out very well. And um, I don't know why it worked out very well. But for some reason, there was a ton of Diamond Ben Simmons point guards posted for the Lolo. And uh, of course, there's none now. But the other day, during the market crash, when the Opal Vince and whatever came out, I bid sniped them for 20K and I sold them for 50K. It was insane. I was so hyped. I also did it with Diamond LeBron James. Pretty much whatever has a lot of, lot of um, spams, bro. Um, Chauncey Billups it worked well with. Like people with a lower MT, if you want, you could try Earl Monroe's, Donovan Mitchell's, whatever you want. Any Amethyst that catches your eye. And also, bro, one snipe filter that was popping today, Amethyst 20 was really good today. I missed out on a KD for 1500 and AD for 1500. If you remember my video, because yo, I had no MT. I literally had 1K MT. I was off by 500. That's sad. I had 1000 MT. But yo, if you guys sit on the snipe filter and anything pops up other than Paul George, it's a snipe. This snipe filter has been good since day one of 2K. No joke. Anything, bro. Anything that pops up for under 4K is a snipe so try this out let me know how it is and i'm sorry if i do sound weird my mouth is killing me i got my wisdom teeth saturday i don't know why it's still killing me it's like someone is in my mouth just punching my teeth like the pain is so bad but you know what? i don't care i'm posting videos anyway um but yo this filter mad money i'm with this filter in general if you have no mt and also bro we're gonna have a how to snipe video later on today it's really really good video i know a lot of people have been asking me yo how do i snipe in 2k i just got the game i heard the game's on sale too i believe i'm not totally sure if the game's on sale bro that video is money so check that out it's also some snipe filters you guys probably missed but i'm at this 2k whatever pops up buy i would stay away from reggie jackson's all you guys that invest in reggie jackson's we're already making 300 mt a pop minimum off those cards so we're pretty lit Amethyst filter is going to slow down as the market does rise up in value. So that's 1L. But yeah, as you can see, the Reggie Jacksons that went up to 2100 MT. I got about 20 of them for 1500 MT. So kind of hyped about that. Um, but yo, Amethyst filter's money. Like I said, you could try the Galaxy Wolf filter. If you do get something, man, congratulations. You made thousands, millions of MT. But right now, man, market's starting to slow down. I expect Spotlight Series due to... Spotlight series do drop uh probably Thursday. I'm not expecting content Friday or unless they drop spotlights Friday. But honestly, I'm not expecting another market crash this week. I think they already set the bar with the buzzer beater packs. But if they do drop some crazy stuff, like I mean a prime, maybe another Galaxy Oval, we will see a giant market crash. But in my opinion, if they continue dropping market crashes, like Galaxy Ovals with market crashes, we're gonna have issues. And also, one more thing. Like, like, the game isn't going to be as hype if they keep dropping opals. That's my opinion, though. But, yo, right now, this Drazen Petrovic might be a really good card to bid. And, honestly, why? Because he's a cheap pink diamond with really, really good stats. And uh, so, he's going for around 53K. So, if you go over here, let's see if we can get one on the bid snipe real quick for you guys. So, all right, that guy just got him for 40 something k I'm actually going to bid on this real quick. For around that price i got it so right there right there i'm gonna sell them for 53k with everything so i got them for 45 53 with the bid i'm gonna make a solid three to 4k real fast because he's gonna sell in seconds so honestly i will take that bro as you can see bro my methods are good like you really can't say they're not i'm just trying to help you guys honestly like if i help you guys it's just a better community it's less toxicity in this community so Hope you guys did enjoy these methods. And let's see what he's going for real quick. So 50,950. And then after that, he's going for around. All right, that just sold. Looks like he might go for like 54. So I'm going to throw him up for 53, 250. I'm going to cut this guy a little bit. Make my quick 4K MT. And yeah, guys, that's really all I got. I really hope you did enjoy this video. I hope it helped you guys out. And yeah, if you need MT, make sure to hit me up. Hit up my sponsors and whatnot. Hope you guys did enjoy the video. Have a good one. Peace.